There we go. Hello, everyone. Hello, friends. Welcome to Story Retold. Kalina here, playing a game for this Halloween season. I've had this game in my library for a while. It looked interesting, uh, and I've never heard about it before or played it, but I bought it because it sounded great. It's called Detective from the Crypt, and this is the opening scene here. Uh, we start with English. Yes, I'm in. I speak English. We'll hit play. Oh, something happened. Something bad happened with our family. The last thing I remember, the happy faces of my parents. Why did I wake up in a crypt? Why did my parents die? I don't remember the last day of my life. Okay, we've got in our book here, we've got notes, files. Oh, father, Lord Dark Day. <laughs> Hot-tempered, ambitious person, a representative of an old aristocratic family. Last night, he had been very sad. Mother, Lady Darkday, her maiden name was Clifford. She loved entertainment and beautiful outfits. She has been very funny lately. Funny, huh? Auntie, red-haired Aunt Esther, frivolous like a child. Sometimes it seems to me that she is younger than me. Jane, calm and reasonable. I've always loved horror stories and wanted to write a book myself. That must be me, Jane. The governess, old Martha. I have remembered her from childhood. Now she is completely gray. She has always been kind to me. Butler George. Our grandfather also hired a butler. George is quite superstitious and reserved. Never speaks in vain. Loves animals very much. Tasks. I have no tasks, but I do have an X out arrow. Oh my. So this is me, huh? Here lies Jane Darkday. This is my coffin. From the outside, the situation must look strange. Oh, I'm clicking to go places. Okay. Uh, so I'm not quite sure how this all works. It looks like it's a point and click. Oh, mother. Okay, let's put her back. Oh, that's, that's my... Okay. Father looks so sad. So here... What is this? It's the fine shape. This must be some kind of note system. The suspects. Oh, we've got a picture here. And all of them. Non-open versions? Five? I don't understand. So is this me, the ghost? Okay. Oh, if I go this way. Oh, I can just click to go places. Oh, this is creepy. Here lies my cousin, who died of measles as a child. The memory of it sends shivers down my spine. Oh, that's all I can look at. Okay. My grandmother is buried here. Grandfather's buried there. Too early to leave. We needed to take a closer look at the crypt. Okay. Um, is there anything that I am overlooking on this side? Maybe we have to go this way. Oh, a letter from the grave from a great grandmother? I can't even imagine her writing a letter there because she's long turned into a skeleton. However, I am a ghost myself and I didn't finish reading what she had to say. I'm taking, I'm talking like a living one. Okay, let's take a look. A letter from the great grandmother. Find Pulcara. She knows a lot and will help you. Take the graveyard candle. A candle from a cemetery has special properties. If its light changes color, then somewhere nearby is a secret passage or a treasure. Okay. Here it is, the candle. So it looks orange right now. The coffin of some ancestor. He's, he's been lying here so long that even the inscription doesn't tell me anything. All right, so that looks like a dead end. I guess we can leave. I'm just gonna keep an eye on that candle. Okay, we can leave now. Oh, what's this? A safe coffin with a bell. If you are buried alive, you need to hold on until something, some help arrives. Ooh. The graves are equipped with special air pipes and bells. If the imaginary dead man pulls the rope, then the bell on his grave will ring. Ugh. Bells ring quite often, but for some reason no one has resurrected so far and left the grave. It turns out that restless souls are ringing the bells. Each one of them has something left to keep them here. 
Oh, so that's where I came from, right? Dr. Oldbeard's grave. Oh. I remember the old doctor. He was very kind. Maybe I can help him with something? Old Redbeard, can you hear me? Hello, doctor. Hello, Miss Jane. Of course, it is very unfortunate that you died at such a young age, but I'm still glad to see you. You look very tired. Unfortunately, even ghosts want to be treated by me and do not listen to any objections. They think they're in pain. All the pain, of course, is phantom, but pa patients still come to me. Some are especially persistent. Mrs. Jones's coughing, for example, keeps all the cemetery awake. <laughs> she had consumption, and although she died, she continues to cough out of habit all night long. Well, that's annoying. I don't have time to make s sleeping pills for everyone. <laughs> what, what to do? I can't offer her other lungs because I'm just a doctor and besides dead. Poor doctor, I am so sorry. Are there many ghosts here? Oh, you can get to know them all yourself. Many appear. One has only touch one has only to touch the bell. Only the mason is very unsociable. He won't just come out of his grave. We last saw him at the party. He likes to eat candy. <laughs> when I was a child, I was scared of ghosts, and now I'm one of them. Some ghosts are quite angry and dangerous to the living of the dead and the dead. Beware of them. These flowers look suspicious. The lilies or something. Old Mrs. Brown is buried here. Her husband often comes to her grave. The poor guy hasn't been feeling very well lately. Shoo, shoo, fly away. Hello, Mrs. Brown. Hello, young lady. Could you help me? Yes, of course. What can I do for you? Oh, Miss Jane, that horrible bird sits here all the time. She's attacking the little bird that used to fly to my grave to sing. I liked her singing so much, and now they don't fly here at all. I tried to chase the crow away, but it's not scared of anything at all. I'll try figure something I'll try to figure something out. Thank you. I'm relying on you. Okay, so we need to figure out how Oh, goody. Is that blue? I'm holding the candle now, that's great. Hello, mister. The weather is so nice today. I haven't been very been happy about anything for a long time. When I was alive, I was unlucky myself and brought misfortune to others. I was an inventor, and the last thing I remember was an explosion in my laboratory. Then not only did I suffer, but also my assistant, although he survived. So all my life I brought people only trouble and problems, and after death, little has changed. For example, a watchman slipped on my grave and twisted his ankle yesterday. It will always be so. It will always be so. But once I wanted people to visit my grave and remember me saying kind words. Don't give up. The luck will be on your side. Okay. Uh, this looks like another crypt. Mm. A greedy bride. Once upon a time, a noble family lived in these lands. Their daughter, Henrietta, loved jewelry more than anything. Noble gentleman offered her a hand and a heart, but she rejected everyone, considering them not rich enough. One of the fans was in love with her, and she reciprocated, but when a richer challenger appeared, she broke off the engagement. The rejected lover committed suicide, but before dying, he had cursed her. Oi. Ew, teeth. Someone lost a jaw? Gross. I bet you we're going to have to come back and pick that up once we know who that is. Vladislav Borgias. Bourgeois? I don't know. It doesn't sound French. That name doesn't mean anything to me. Oh, look, another jaw. Skeletons and bones are scattered everywhere. What happened here? Oh, dear. Oh. Oh! Wow! Four arms? What? That's freaky. Oh, let's take a shovel. Great. I feel like there's jewelry hidden somewhere in the cemetery. Bring them to me or you'll regret it. Okay, but let me go. If you don't bring the jewelry, I'll curse you. Can I go this way? It looks like the monster draws strength from the souls of the people buried here. Creepy. Alright, so that, if that's a dead end, 
I need to bring her jewelry. I'm glad she's chained up. Oh, look at this. Oh, I guess. No, that's it. Okay. So I need to find jewelry for the ghost. Creepy monster. Hey. <gasps> A bagpipes player. Would you like to listen to music, miss? You are probably very fond of music if you play even after death. I swore that I would become a famous musician and make a lot of money. Only when my talent is appreciated, I will return to my homeland. Yes, I would like to listen to music. Are you going to play for me? It's lovely. Okay, there are bubbles in there. I don't know where I'm going. Oh! A broken golden watch. Water and moss got under the glass. The hand stopped at two o'clock. The inscription on the watch, to my dear Oscar, that was the name of the artist who painted our portraits and suddenly disappeared. It's lovely. Oh, an old newspaper. The bone had been gnawed by some big animal. Um, so is that, I can't look at it, can I? I can't go any further? Three days before the death, I heard something howling. It could have been some poor animal that was tied up here. Yeah, it looks like it. Post, huh? You don't see anything else I could actively click on out here in the swamp. So I suppose... We'll just make our way back. I mean, the bubbles concern me, like there's something in the water. Okay, back to... The I wonder if, um... The ghost would appreciate uh, the watch. We'll give it a try. Oh, we go down in the hold. <gasps> oh, that was a great delayed reaction. Okay, where are my inventory items? Is this it? Uh, that's the suspects. Is this, oh, this is my purse. Okay, great. Here, can I give that to you? Oh, she doesn't want that. Okay, I don't know who gets the watch. Oh, I see, it's a pit, and she lets the stepping stones come out for me to go back up. Okay, good, my watch is back in there. Great. I didn't want to lose that. This is a very ambient game. Um, can I use the shovel to smack the... That won't work? Okay. Shiny watch. That won't work. Okay. I guess we're going to venture to the far right. Dr. Oldbeard. What did he want? What did he need? Wait. Can I ring this bell? Candle changes color. There's a secret passage or a treasure near here. They've been digging here recently. The soil in this place is loose. Well, where is this secret passage? Is it with the angel? Is it... Oh, what's this? Hello. Oh, he's silent. Goodbye. All right. Okay, so it's somewhere like right around here. And I don't know how to act. I don't know what I'm supposed to be clicking on in order to get to the secret passage here. Yeah, it's in this soil. I don't know. Oh well, I'll come back to it then. 
Hello, Mrs. Jones. How are you feeling? Oh, don't ask. Just awful. This cough drives me crazy. For many nights, it's been torturing me from dusk to dawn. The doctor prescribed medicine for me, but it doesn't help me at all. Goodbye. Take care. That's, that's all I can do. Okay. I feel like I'm not making any sort of progress. Dark day. Is that to our home? I wasn't listening. What's this? A four-leaf clover is for good luck. Nice. Oh, look at the kitty cat. There's something written on the monument, but it's impossible to read. The letters are, are too... Two should have two O's right here. Too small. To the park, huh? I don't have a magnifying glass, so I'm not sure how to read it. Oh! Mom's old boots. They shall be examined more ac they shall be examined more accurately. Should? Shall? How do we? I don't know. A hollow. It's empty on the inside. Ooh. <gasps> uh oh. Uh oh. Uh <laughs> oh. Bought it. I'm a ghost. You can't kill me. I want to play. Let's trade. Do you have anything interesting? Trade? How about a four-leaf clover? That's not interesting. A watch? No. A shovel? No. Okay, so I need to find him something? Oh dear. I don't have anything. Hmm. What if I put a four-leaf clover in the hollow? <laughs> I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. Yeah, I don't... I don't know. Maybe I'll talk to all the characters again. All the ghosts. <gasps> what is this? Find out where the fabric is torn from. You need to find a dress or suit of a, fam a similar color to attach the fabric to it. Okay. There are many crows in our garden. So it's like a purple fabric of some sort, huh? I can't pass through the door. Some invisible barrier is not letting me in. Okay. Oh, I can go around, though. <gasps> Ooh, side door. Look at all these bottles. That looks like a potential puzzle, actually. The candle changes color. Secret passage or treasure here. Ah, the brickwork in this place is different from the rest of the wall. Maybe there's a treasure hidden here. Okay, can I press it? What do I do about... Yeah, I don't know what to do about it. Wait, can I go in through there? No, maybe not. Just left and right. A box of chocolates. You think the boy would like that? I can't go inside. The invisible barrier won't let me in. Salt is scattered on the steps. I need to remove it somehow, but I'm too weak to break the spell. Salt. Can I use the fabric? It's very pretty. Okay, I can't do that. Well, we have the chocolate now. Hey, what is this? The gear thing? Oh, sound. Okay. Let's save. save my game. I don't know if it's possible to lose. Okay, how do I access the secret passage though?
Okay, find the treasures. Help Ghost Boy. Help Mrs. Brown. Annoyed by the crow. Bad lungs. I don't... Why is the spelling here different than this spelling? Pulcheria? Pulcheria. I don't know. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what to do about that secret passage. Can't click on anything. Ah, uh, secret passage here too. What's that sound? Do I use my... Oh, I can use my arrow keys to move, but I can't go up and down. Huh. Now let's head over to the park. Maybe we can offer the chocolates to the boy. I wish I could take the boots, but I don't know why I would need that and what relevant, why they are relevant. You want chocolate? Really? Okay. Well, let's go on a fabric hunt then. Wait, is this a thing? That's just a different stone. Okay. What if we put chocolates in there? I can't. And she won't stop. She only goes to the next marker. Hmm. Okay. Is that like the whooshing of bird feathers? Can I offer you chocolate? No. Oh, what's this? Oh, he has a new symbol right there I didn't see before. They said that his bride was a maid, and, on, and one day she disappeared. They said that she ran away with the footman from our house. The mason was very upset and withdrawn into himself. It seems that even now his ghost does not communicate with others, but sits in the grave and doesn't go anywhere. Okay. Another passage that I have no idea what to do. Wait, what did he say about candy? Oh, the mason likes to eat candy. Okay, we'll give him the chocolate. Aw, he comes out. There's something hidden in the wall of the cellar. I need your help. Help me take apart the wall. Okay, I'm coming. Great, we've got his help. Is it it's this way, right? Or is it to the park? I forget which way. Am I supposed to wait for him? Okay. Oh good, he arrived. Oh goody goody. Let's see what's hidden here. There can be anything in such an old wall. There's a dead body! Whoa! Hello, my beloved David. Mary, is that you? I thought you ran away with the footman. I've always loved only... I always loved only you. The footman chased me and killed me when I refused to date him. From now on, we will always be together, my dear Mary. Miss Jane, I owe you my release. What can I do for you? The butler, George, is very superstitious, and he put salt on the doorsteps at the door. I can't get through the barrier. Can you help me get rid of the salt? I'm the maid of this house, and no spells can stop me from performing my duties. I have to make sure it's clean here. <laughs> oh 
Oh, my Amazon package arrived. Thank you. I can go inside now. Yay. <gasps> There's stuff in here. A magnifying glass to read the statue. Yay. Matches. Powder for making hot chocolate. The aunt and governess always drink hot chocolate before bed. Milk. The bricklayer loves candy and probably some of the ghosts also love milk. Okay. There's a lot of interesting things here. Empty saucepan, probably to make the chocolate then. Warmth is coming from the fireplace. Oh. Oh, goody. Okay, so we can make hot chocolate, I guess. Exotic spices and an expensive olive oil are kept here. The box is locked. You need a key. All right, dishes that we can't take. Can't take any of the glassware, teapots, or teacups. Don't know where it would be hidden. What's in the next room? <gasps> Ooh, bells. The revived armor prevents you from passing by. We need to stop them somehow. The servants are called by bells. I don't need to call anyone now. Okay. I like the mixed um, media, the mixed art. Ooh, wasp cy cyanide bottle. Oh, could take the poison from here. Okay. Grapes. Ooh, boots. Butler's boots. Some kind of grass has stuck to them. Take a closer look. Do we use the magnifying glass on that? The butler went to the swamps. The swamp moss stuck to his boots. That's probably, I wonder if he was keeping the dog or a, a beast of some sort, you know? A garden trowel, okay. Kerosene. Interesting flowers. Ooh, an insect landing net. We have a lot to explore now. Pretty flowers. Something is buried here. Let's use the trowel. Rusty shackles. Nothing else, huh? Odd. Oh, I can float across the pond. <gasps> oh. I haven't learned to walk on water. Uh, let's use a net. Yeah, gold locket on the pond. A lock of hair, some hair inside. No portrait or photograph. Wonder whose hair it is, okay. I wonder if I can give that um, to that locket counts as jewelry for the uh, cranky monster ghost. How about the shovel? Okay, I guess I'm done with this environment right here. Unless we need to come back to the shackles, which is, you know, possible. Nothing else here. It's pretty. We got a vital clue there. Wait. No, just the bottle. Okay. Do we have to make hot chocolate now? How do we stop them? Do we... Start fighting them with a shovel? <laughs> I do not know. I feel like we need to be making food or something. We've got kerosene. Can open and close that, but 
All right, so we put, uh, shall we put a saucepan on? Oh, uh, we need water? Well, what water do we collect, though? Do we combine the, uh, milk? Or... Do I have to get it from the pond? Aha! A sink. Very nice. Placed on the stove. Okay, what's under here though? <gasps> a crowbar. Whether you need to fix the tap or beat the dough, the kitchen is a perfect place for any crowbar. <laughs> okay, that's the only thing I can take from here and here, and that's the dead end. All right. So if we put the saucepan with water on the stove, what else can we do? Where is it? Right here. No reason to boil the water. Okay, fine. What if we put the powder for making hot chocolate in the pot? We can't. All right, I don't understand. Are we supposed to get like a cup ready? I don't know. No, my cats are trying to get in. All right, what am I supposed to be doing though? Because we've got kerosene, we've got a match. We've got hot chocolate and milk. I guess it comes with a cup. Powder for making hot chocolate. I can't combine items here. Why won't it let me? No reason to boil the water. Then why do we have a pot of water? I wonder if I can use the crowbar. Oh, the shovel on the loose stone. Or the loose uh, dirt back. We'll try some other things first. We've got a long ways to walk. Creepy. Mm hmm secret passage should be nearby. I mean, do we go up? There's no hot spot around in this area. I mean, unless it's indicating this. Oh, I can go in the front door. Oh, we're on the other side. How nice. <gasps> Wait, what's this? I can't pass through the mirror. Grandma told me to find Pulcheria. Maybe that will help me. Okay. Find Pulcheria. I don't know who that is. I can open and close a drawer that has no use to me. Okay. Nice to know that I can go through this front door now. Let's go dig up some graves. Oh, we can use the magnifying glass though on the cat statue. <gasps> That's the cat, Pulcaria. There's something written on the monument, but it's impossible to read. The letters are too small. Well, yeah, let's use the magnifying glass. Why can't I look at it closer with the magnifying glass? Okay. Um, I got nothing. I don't know. So the cat is Pulcaria. Interesting name. This is Jones. Oh wait, let's go to the secret passage spot. Maybe we can dig uh, right here. Yay! A treasure box. 
the family jewelry. Someone hid our family jewels in the cemetery. I wonder if their disappearance is related to our death. This is very suspicious. We can take the jewelry, though, to the creepy ghost. Is it here? Or is it the next one? I think it was the next one, right? Yeah, it must be this next one. Yeah, let's, let's go someplace. Let me check on the time. All right, I got another 10 minutes or so. Uh, up the stairs. Um, here. All right, let's drop into the pit. Right here. Ah! <laughs> I brought you my family jewels. Where did they go? You're not gonna let me give them to her. Uh-oh. very strange. Where did they go? Are, are they a clue, though? Was I- did I pick them up? Did I not take them? Oh, that'd be very frustrating. Huh. That's really creepy right there. <laughs> So my name is Jane. Jane Darkday. Okay, now I took them. They're in my inventory now? Great. Oh goodness, that was frustrating. I clicked on them once to read about them and then uh, click, I have to click on them twice to... <laughs> You don't want to give our family jewels to the greedy bride. I don't believe she's going to let me go, and I don't want to get a curse. Oh, okay. What do I do then? Okay, he's no help. I don't know how to get rid of the bird. Oh, let's ask the... Let's ask him to play music. Will that help? Yeah, how do I make him play music? Way to get a hint. Hmm. Two more, two clues against the butler. Governors could have stolen it, yeah. The aunt had access to family jewelry. Mom had access to family jewelry. Uh, her father did not. Oh, I got a couple things crossed off. Lungs. Annoyed by the crow. Help a loser? You need to help the loser? Who's the... Oh. The knight? Who might fight and lose? I don't know who... I haven't seen anything purple to match the clothes. Compare the hair in the locket with the father's hair. How do I examine the hair in the locket, though? Do I use the uh, magnifying glass on the locket? I can't, I still can't do that. Okay. 
do I do the what do I use the crowbar for? Well, we've got some inventory to try using on the crow. Okay, we don't interact with a crow. Matches. No. Uh, kerosene? I have no idea. It's not scared of anything at all. I am out of ideas. Does Mrs. Jones like hot chocolate? Does she like cocoa? I feel like I need to make something in the, in the, um... Back to the kitchen or something, you know? Okay, I can't give her the milk. That's too bad that I can't use the magnifying glass. Oh, I have got this now. Did I have to double click? Huh, I don't know. How do I scare away the crow? Why, well, why did the icon show up in the bottom right corner, though, for me, for the... Is there a, a spot that I'm not... Double-clicking doesn't help? Is it because we don't have... Well, we need a candle to light stuff? No idea. Well, let's, let's go visit the boy again. Maybe he has an interest in something. Can we examine the shoes? Swamp moss on the boots. Why is the magnifying glass on fire? You can't really see the icon on the screen. Maybe we have to go back to the swamp. It's empty, huh? Maybe if we put something in it? Okay, do you want the watch? No. Four leaf clover? No. Torn fabric? No. Matches. Oh, come on, every kid likes matches. Cocoa? Milk. Kerosene. Lock it? No. A pot of water. <laughs> Crowbar. Jules. He wants nothing. I don't want to go that way. Let's go back to the house and see what we can learn there. I'm really frustrated about the cat statue. Someone dead. No, like katakana symbols or Chinese symbols or something back there. Hmm. Well. Secret passage. What do we examine the wall? Do we crowbar the wall? I don't understand it. Okay. 
If you guys have played this game before... Oh, that's the... That is an exit. Okay. No idea. But I feel like it might be behind the ivy or something, you know? I have nothing to cut the ivy with. I do have crowbar, but it will not let me use it. Okay, we can run the water. Great. I can't take anything else on here. Okay. So I take it that I can interact with this somehow. Do I put the pot in the fireplace? No reason to boil the water. How about the milk? How about the cocoa? Kerosene, a bad idea. This is frustrating. Fire? I mean, it's already lit. Am I missing something entirely? And I'm missing a key. A drawer that opens and I have nothing to put in there or to take out. Ah, huh. okay. Well, I am at a loss. I don't want to go in here. Is there a, uh, like a integrated hint system? accidentally clicked on a direction. Um, I am baffled. That must be exit. So I'll save the game and you know what? Um, I'm going to take a break and I will come back to this in another video. That's not how you spell my name. We we'll do that. Anyways, stay tuned for the next episode. And if you have ideas, clues, tips, or tricks, comment below. See ya!